Welcome to Affinity Designer. In this video, I'll show you how you can edit the text of a PDF so you can make changes to documents without access to the original project file. Here I have a PDF poster which advertises a saving of 25% with an end date in 2016. If I want to use the exact same poster for a similar campaign next year, I need to change the date. I can do this using Affinity Designer. From the file menu, select Open. Select the PDF and click Open. If you're interested in editing the text of the PDF, the following options are important. Favour editable text over fidelity will open the PDF in such a way as to make text editing easier, though it might compromise on the layout of the PDF to accommodate this. I recommend selecting this option. Group lines of text into text frames will put lines of text which are located close together in a single text object. This should improve the reflow of text when you make any edits. So I recommend leaving this option selected. Any fonts within the PDF which are not present on your system will display here. If the PDF contains missing fonts, you can either source the original font or substitute the font once the PDF is opened in Affinity Designer. Once the options are set to your preferences, click Open. Here on the Layers panel, you can see the effect of grouping lines of text into single text objects, with some text presented as frame text and some as artistic text. For the purpose of this video, I'll edit the text in this frame here. With the layer selected, I simply select a text tool from the Tools panel. It doesn't really matter which. And the frame is ready to be edited. I can drag to select the area I want to change, for instance the 6 of 2016, and then I type 7. I can also centre the text using the options on the Context toolbar. I can edit this artistic text layer in a similar way. Once I've finished the edits, I can save the file using the Save option on the File menu, so I have a designer project file for later. And I can export it using the option on the File menu as a PDF. And there you go. Before and after. You can find out more information about working with text and PDFs using our comprehensive help system and other video tutorials, all accessible via the help menu. Thanks for watching.